decide today to always call out and uphold what's most beautiful in the other person. Even when you don't feel like it, there will be many moments when you're going to have the opportunity to speak truth and encourage one another. You are standing next to a partner who will see you at your most vulnerable and most laughable moments. As the person that is closest to it all, remind one another of what's most true, most right, and most beautiful. It's been eight years since we first met. We have grown up together and have been so fortunate to experience so many adventures already with one another. You are a man that continues to amaze me every day. A man who gives me a kiss every morning and tells me how beautiful I look. A man who told me he always envisioned proposing on a beach and went above and beyond and planned the most perfect proposal in Malibu. Gemma, I've been waiting for this day for a long time now. It takes me back eight years to one of the first times we hung out together at Miami. And I'll, I'll never forget thinking to myself that this is a girl I could see myself marrying. I've always known that you were the one for me. You light up every room you walk into, and no matter how hard people try, they cannot stop staring at you because they see the same beautiful woman that I've fallen in love with. so proud to be able to call you my girlfriend over all these years and I want to thank you for making them the best years of my life. I've never been more sure about a decision than the commitment I'm making to you today in marriage. You'll always be more than just a wife to me Beanie. You're my best friend and I truly mean that. There's no one else in this world that I love spending time with more than you. I always considered myself a skeptic of love, but you have proved me wrong over and over again. I am reminded every day how lucky I am to be with you and what a wonderful husband you will make. You constantly ask me, what did I do to deserve you, when really I know I should be asking that question to you. There are so many things in life I am uncertain about, but I do know for sure that I found myself the most genuine man and am so ready to continue this journey with you by my side. Can't wait to see you later today, Bean. Love you forever. You've been the best friend and lover to me through all the good times and the bad. You've always been there for me and have been the rock. I lean on in tough times. Thank you for always being there for me and always having my back. I'm so excited for today and whatever tomorrow brings us. As long as we are together, I'll be happy. I love you so much. This is Gemma's story about how they met in her exact words. 
Let's rewind to summer going into freshman year of college at Miami University. I acted like I wanted his friend to come to the party and Kevin was just an afterthought because I didn't want to be overly eager. It turned out that I left such a good impression that only his friend showed up and not Kevin. <laughs> and I see him and I'm trying to play it cool, but I'm nervous, excited, happy, all of those emotions mixed into one. I walked over to Kevin and I think I said something like, why didn't you come by last night? And that started the conversation. Kevin, here are the things that Gemma most loves about you. I love when you block the door in the morning and say you have one more minute until you can leave, just to make sure you get every second with me before we go to work. I love that you know me better than I know myself and always give me confidence to be true to who I am. Gemma, here are the things that Kevin most loves about you. Gemma, when we hug and you hang your head back, staring up at me, I can forget about all my problems and get lost in the moment every time. You are the most beautiful woman to me, especially with no makeup on, with your naturally curly hair that you don't let anyone else see. Kevin, I love coming home to you every night knowing I will always walk through the door to a huge hug and you saying, did you kiss me yet? Meaning, you are my best friend. I am completely happy when I am with you and will never let that end. After all these years, I am still amazed by your selfless, caring, and optimistic nature. I promise to keep you safe and love you through the good times and in the bad. I promise to never stop making up nicknames for you and to tell you how beautiful you are each and every day. I promise to return the love and respect you have always shown me in every day to come. I promise to support and inspire your dreams and to make our lives together never boring. I vow to be your partner in this crazy journey we call life by celebrating your success and supporting your setbacks. I will remain loyal and continue to appreciate each day together. I promise to always strive to be your loving husband and never give up on what we have. Today, I vow these things to you. I love you. I am proud to be your wife. Thank you for making me a believer in love. I promise to never let you down. Gemma, you are absolutely gorgeous, stunning, and brilliant, and more importantly, you are just a good, loving, caring human. Kevin, you have a heart of gold, and there is no one in the world that can take care of Gemma the way that you do. Kevin just kind of looks over at me and says, I'm, I'm never going to find a girl better than Gemma. I'd like to formally invite you into the family as my big sister, so welcome. <laughs> Gemma and Kevin are a match made in heaven. Gemma makes quick decisions, Kevin's analytical. Gemma's extremely intense, Kevin's laid back. Kevin likes to take photographs, Gemma loves to have her photo taken. Sometimes it's okay to throw away the protective gear. Continue to take chances, even if it seems like a bad idea. You're guaranteed to have a great time and more likely than not, it's going to lead to something great.
and you look at the ceremony and you look at this place here tonight and it's just a fantastic evening. This girl standing next to me is really the love of my life and I really don't think that you know I could be as happy as I am today without her.